Hello everyone and welcome to my Sister Wives Today channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. In the midst of the Cody feud, Sister Wives Janelle Brown praises son Gabe for always checking on his mama. In spite of his alienation from his father, Cody Brown, Sister Wives actress Janelle Brown congratulated her son Gabe Brown on his birthday. Happy birthday at Gabe Brown, the 54-year-old TLC star wrote with a collection of beautiful videos on Wednesday, October 11. I sincerely hope your next year is the best one yet. The six-child mother ended her heartfelt remark by praising her kid, who feels deeply and has the tenderest of hearts, for being the one who is always checking on his mama. Following concerns, she expressed about Gabe, 22, and her son Garrison Brown's mental health in the midst of intense conflict with their father, Janelle paid tribute to her son. In the Sunday, October 8 episode of the long-running series, Gabe said, Me and Garrison are at odds with my dad because when we communicated our discontent with how things were going with COVID, I was met with just a wall, and there was no conversation. That, in my opinion, is what actually separated us. Janelle said that Garrison, 24, seems angry or sadder, like he's not as happy-go-lucky as he used to, in her own confessional. I've been concerned about the emotional health of my guys, the TLC celebrity stated. Gabriel has a very, very deep sense of things. He is, however, also the child who remains silent. In contrast, Cody, 54, acknowledged feeling powerless in his interactions with his elder children. The 18-year-old boy's father acknowledged that things started to unravel after they were unable to resolve their historical problems, noting his stringent guidelines during the COVID-19 pandemic. A relationship with a 10-year-old, 5-year-old, or newborn is very different from your relationship with a 15-year-old, 20-year-old, 25-year-old, or 30-year-old. It's extremely different, the Patriarch of Brown said in an interview with People that was released on October 4. I lack the authority to establish these regulations in my home. He continued by saying that the family was going through very difficult circumstances at the time and expressed his wish that they would move forward and hopefully heal these relationships. The main source of friction in Cody and Janelle's marriage, their disagreements with their sons, led to their separation in December 2022. Even during the latest season's heated conflict over their elder sons, which began on August 20, fans of Sister Wives were able to witness. The Plexus ambassador was attacked at the time for her lack of loyalty and for not assisting Cody in communicating with their sons and adhering to family traditions. In the episode from September 3, Janelle said, It still surprises me that Cody thinks like it's my duty to facilitate this relationship between he and my children. He's a parent just as much as I am. Logan, Maddie, Hunter, and Savannah are other children Janelle and Cody share in addition to Gabe and Garrison. Following Christine's marriage, Cody Brown shuts down the family business. Over the years, Cody Brown registered a number of family businesses, however he recently closed one of them. It comes after the announcement that Christine Brown and David Woolley were married last weekend. Fans of the TLC series Sister Wives are aware that the patriarch worked many jobs, which company was recently shut down? Find out by reading on. The spiritual husband of Mary, Janelle, and Christine Brown worked in the antiques industry before to joining COVID. However, that position was eliminated by the pandemic, which he also partially attributed to the breakdown of his marriages. He was seen selling firearms at numerous gun shows more recently. He did, however, once brag that he had many irons in the fire. Obviously, the Sister Wives television program is likely his primary source of income, but he also planned for additional revenue sources. The majority of TLC viewers are aware that Cody Brown registered Cody Brown Family Entertainment LLC in 2019. All four of his ex-wives were identified as management for that company. In 2022, he did list another business, though. DBS ARK Entertainment LC, according to the Ashley's Reality Roundup, reported the information. Dayton, Aurora, Brianna, Solomon, Ari, Robin, and Cody are represented by the acronym DABS ARK, according to the source. Did he shut down that company? According to a revised Sun report, Cody Brown Family Entertainment, LLC filed for bankruptcy on October 8. 
In reality, Christine and David Woolley were married the day before the filing was made. Was the timing retaliatory? Well, according to the source, the company license is still in effect in Arizona, where he currently resides, despite the business being dissolved in Nevada. So the specifics are not entirely obvious. On the day that David Woolley married his former third wife, Cody Brown undoubtedly wasn't in a good mood. He may wish to concentrate on safeguarding his money for Robin, his preferred wife, now that Janelle, Mary, and Christine Brown are independent earners. Fans of Sister Wives are naturally quite eager to criticize him for D-A-B-S-A or K because it especially benefits Robin Brown and her children. The TLC star appears to have abandoned his other children from previous relationships financially unstable. Fans got to see Cody Brown's poor parenting in season 18. He never actually parented all of his children at once because of the long absences caused by his past lifestyle, particularly coming from Christine's son Peyton. Bitterness is clear. The sons of Janelle, Gabe, and Garrison openly dislike their father. What do you think about Cody Brown closing the Nevada company where all the wives were listed as managers? Brown's Robin and Cody true sociopaths or poor editing perhaps? Fans of Sister Wives are not fond of Robin Brown and her husband, Cody Brown. In fact, it seems like every episode attracts more detractors, but are these people sociopaths or do they suffer from poor editing? Some viewers inquire as to if the production staff likes to edit them and gaslight the monogamous pair. Fans of TLC are persuaded that the patriarch of Sister Wives and his favorite wife purposefully excluded Christine, Janelle, and Mary Brown from the family. Of course, he denied it, and the wife who succeeded Mary as the sole legitimate spouse claimed she made efforts to maintain the polygamous family's unity. There is a general consensus among TLC fans that Robin Brown and Cody are the worst narcissists on reality TV. Mary eventually understood that she needed to go, although the other women all went of their own will. Amazingly, she still expresses her love for her ex-husband openly. People are upset because they believe that the last surviving wife secretly wished for her to depart. Fans of reality television who frequent Reddit are torn. Whatever the case, it still doesn't look well for the monogamous pair. The social media platform featured two distinct threads that covered two different perspectives. An OP said in a conversation about Sister Wives, the editing this season has me cackling. Others took pleasure in the conversation that ensued. One critic of the editing remarked, I'm enjoying these humorous moments of cerebral short-circuiting. I don't think Robin and Cody Brown are depicted in a good light with editing. I don't know how the family has managed with this lack of mental clarity. Production must be enjoying it as well, I suppose. It's really terrible that having to negotiate this mess must be incredibly frustrating for some people. The couple's poor behavior was the subject of another TLC discussion. The OP was indignant, writing, Cody not being honest with Mary. Being way dishonest with Mary by Robin is really disgusting. We all know she has been convicted, so why didn't they release her sooner by being truthful? They said, if there was ever any question that Robin and Cody are sociopathic users who don't care about anyone but themselves, the proof is in this horrific scenario. Fans of Sister Wives on that forum think it's not the editing. Robin and Cody Brown don't actually require assistance. Her disguise is slipping, a commenter exclaimed. She appears to be a total narcissism freak who is in a panic because they are running out of control. Long ago, someone needed to tell her to shut up. She has crazy balls to sit there and attempt to explain how Cody works to a woman who has been married to him for 20 years longer than she has. Thanks for watching if you liked this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.